This is how I make lasagna, based on a recipe by Elizabeth David. Start by making your meat sauce, aka ragu, with 500 grams of beef mince, 250 of pork mince, which you can get from the supermarket or by asking your butcher nicely, one onion, two carrots, a stick of celery if you have it, a large glass of red wine or sherry or white wine or water, a glug of oil, a tin of tomatoes, a pack of mushrooms, a stock cube or pot, some tomato puree and some garlic or garlic puree. Start by warming the oil in a big pan and then chopping your onion finely. Add your garlic, if you have it, at this time. Then peel and chop the carrots finely. If you have celery, chop the celery finely too and add it to the saucepan. Then chop your mushrooms finely and add them to the pan also. When the vegetables are softened, add the pork and beef mince. You could also use courgette and aubergine in this recipe. Mix well and don't add anything else until the mince is browned. Then add the remaining ingredients, the wine or water, the tinned tomatoes, the tomato puree and the stock pot. Now it's time to make the white sauce, aka bechamel with 25 to 30 grams of butter, one to two tablespoons of plain flour, one and a quarter pints of warm milk, and some nutmeg. Start by warming the milk, including a bay leaf if you wish to for flavor. Then grind your nutmeg, if you're using whole nutmeg, ready for the recipe. Start by melting the butter on a low heat. Then add the flour and nutmeg and stir. When it's well mixed, slowly add small amounts of milk, stirring regularly and every time it thickens, adding an extra bit of milk until all the milk is used up. When it's simmering, cook your mixture for another 10 to 15 minutes. Now it's time to assemble your lasagna with a thin layer of meat, a thin layer of bechamel, a thin scattering of cheese, and then lasagna. You repeat until you're reaching almost the top, then you finish with bechamel. You may have some ragu left over, which I did have, which I will use for spaghetti bolognese and then you put your mixture into the oven for about 40 minutes to an hour on a low heat, about 150 degrees to 180 degrees.